And I've been playing music for as long as I can remember, pretty much. I remember um, when I was about maybe six or so, I remember we had a piano in the house, but this was before I took lessons. And my father had showed me how to make uh, animated movies and like margins in books. And my mother was a scholar and she had wall to wall books. So I had plenty of, you know, open canvas for my movies, you know. And so I used to make these long epic cartoons that would take, you know, 15 books or more. And um, I, um, my, one of my, my main character in my cartoons was Griffy Grasshooper. And I wrote a little piece on the piano and that was Griffy Grasshooper's theme. And I remember that being the first piece of music that I composed. And I think I was, I was around six, maybe five when I wrote that. My sister tells me that I was playing as early as three years old. I don't, I don't remember that. And um, I played piano up until about the age 10. And then we fell into some hard times. My folks had to sell the piano. And that was when I got the guitar, which opened up a whole new thing for me because I loved guitar and I had always wanted to play. A lot of the music I was getting interested in had a lot of guitar in it. And so I was able to persuade my folks to get me this guitar. And I stayed up all night and by the morning I was playing it and that was when I was 11. That was for Christmas when I was 11. And so after playing guitar for several years and knowing that guitar was really my favorite instrument, I started to realize that I still liked a lot of the pianistic possibilities. So I worked out a way to play the guitar in a kind of pianistic way and that's what I today call the touch technique. And so a lot of people know me for that. But uh, before I did that, I was playing conventional guitar for like six years. So that's kind of just the synopsis of my instrumental beginnings. And music therapy and music healing has been something that I've known about one way or another for quite a while because I had some early experiences with it. I remember one time I had a date to get together with this girl in high school. She was a keyboard player and we were going to get together and, and play music. And I called her up because I had come down with the flu. And I said, look, I'm really sorry, but I, I'm sick today. I don't know if I can do it. And she said, well, cool, whatever, whatever you want is cool. And then I thought about it and I realized, well, if I'm going to feel bad, I might as well do something I enjoy. You know, I don't want to sit around just feeling bad. So I called her back and I said, hey, can I come over anyway? She said, okay, no problem. So I went over there and we played all day. And the amazing thing was that at the end of the day, I could really feel... The difference like it was like it was like I had just processed this flu right out of my system or something just from making music and I remember thinking wow that's strange I didn't know you could do that with music and then I just kind of filed that away in my mind you know and then years later I had this funny thing that came to me um, when, okay when I'm getting ready to do a show I have to be alone I have to have my peace and quiet but this one day, I had this weird urge to just walk right out into the middle of the audience, right before a show. And so I started walking out there, and immediately I was approached by this woman who said, do you know anything about music therapy? And I thought, okay, I guess that's why I'm, I'm here. I said, well, no, not really, but you know, I believe that music can heal, but tell me more about it. And she said, well, I'm a music therapist, and I didn't know there was any such thing. And she said, I'd like to tell you more about it, and I've got some information that I can send you. So I said, sure, yes, yeah, send, send it to me. And she sent me way more stuff than I expected. And that's when I started to get hooked, because I saw not just the quantity, but also the quality of the science behind this. And I was really impressed by that.